Hello, my name is Tim Stoddart. I am the CEO of Stodzy Incorporated, partner in Copyblogger Media, owner of Server Nation. Thank you so much for, for joining me in the first video of this course. You are watching this video because you want to learn how to build a business. You want to learn how to generate income on your own, but you're not interested in creating a huge venture backed company and you're, you're interested in staying focused and you're interested in generating revenues and generating profits. That's what this course is for. This is for regular people who want to bootstrap a business. This isn't for the next visionary who is going to create another Apple. There's people out there that can do that. And if you're one of those people, then that's great. That's just not what this course is for. This course is for the majority of people who want to build a very, very profitable business and they want to do it simply and strategically without investors, without venture backing, without taking on some debt. You want to do it with the money that's in your own pocket so that you can build a better life for yourself and do what you want to do. That's what this course is for. There's four steps to this process. And these four steps are very important that you follow in a certain order. Because if you go the reverse order, a lot of times what happens is you start focusing on the wrong things. And your focus is very, very important if you are serious about creating a business that puts passive income into your bank account or even a business that scales to the point where you're not trading your time for money. Okay, so what are these four stages? Step number one is cash flow. Every business needs cash flow. Now, there's a lot of different ways to generate cash flow. Some people keep their day job and they start their new business on the side. Some people start by doing uh, client services work where you have a couple clients and you're exchanging your time for money. Uh, all of these options are fine. The point is every business needs cash flow. You can't make progress if you don't have revenue coming in, if you don't have cash flow. And we're going to go through a lot of these different options and break it down for you. Uh, the second step is distribution. So cash flow is great, but eventually you want to put yourself in a position where you're not working so often. You don't want to trade your job, which you don't enjoy, for a business that you don't enjoy. Right? If you're working 60 hours a week right now and you don't like your boss, well, you're going to like your boss even less if you don't enjoy the work that you're doing and your boss is you. <laughs> right? So uh, distribution is very important. Distribution means building an audience, basically. Distribution means having a network of people who you can promote yourself to. Uh, in this method, we focus very, very heavily on building an email list. But we also use social media. So we're going to talk about Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube. We're going to talk about building a website. We're going to talk about blogging. Uh, there's a lot of different ways to generate a following. But the critical point in having a distribution is that your email address is the only distribution channel that like you actually own. It's yours. You can take it with it everywhere you go. Whereas a social media following uh, or even a YouTube following you don't have ownership over. You don't own your Twitter page. Twitter does. And so that's why as we use these other tools to build a distribution network, all roads are, are going to leave lead to the email address. Okay, great. Uh, stage number three is monetization, right? We are not in this for the likes. We're not in this for the popularity. We don't care about who has the newest NFT or ha who has the most social media followers. We care about how much revenue our business is generating and how much we're profiting off of that. It is this focal point in the monetization step that will determine whether you're gonna be an entrepreneur, a business owner who truly finds success, or if you're gonna be a one-apreneur, right? If you're gonna be an entrepreneur who loves calling yourself an entrepreneur, but it's just barely getting by and is spending a lot of time acting the part 
as opposed to being the part. So if you want to be the part, the purpose of any business is to create goods and services in exchange for money. And so a successful entrepreneur creates goods and services that are so valuable that they make a ton of money. That's what you want. You want to have money in your bank account. Don't ever take your eye off of this prize. Everything else is a distraction. You know, so like I said, in step two, in the distribution phase, like we can use social media and your audience and your popularity uh, and some of the more glitz and glam type things that people get caught up in with entrepreneurship. We can use that to build your distribution. But step three is about making money, making sales. And we're going to talk to you about how to do that. And then finally, step four is scale. At the end point of every company, what you want to do is find ways to replace yourself. Eventually, you want to get to the point where you're working on the business. So you're not doing the day-to-day work anymore. Your full focus is just figuring out how to scale the business, how to make it so that your revenues and your profits are growing at an exponential rate um, in relation to your expenses. Um, And in addition, there's, there's a lot of different ways that scale can happen because not every business model is the same. Right. Let's imagine that you are selling courses. Well, you're probably not going to need as many employees. And so like your scalability might take off in a certain way. Uh, Let's imagine you're building a marketing agency. Well, you're going to need people on your team. So then you would approach scale in a much different way because you have to make sure you build a system for your people and for your employees. And so it's this scalability that will get you to the point where you're not so focused on the day-to-day aspects of the business. And then this is really where you get to live your life and do what you want to do. You have complete freedom over your time. This isn't a scheme. This isn't teaching you how to build, you know, some kind of funnel so that money just (laughs) magically starts pouring into your bank account without doing hard work. This is honest work for honest results, but there's a system here that truly makes it so that in time, you make more and you work less. And that's what we want. That's, that's how to build a real cash flowing, profit generating business with no debt and no venture backing that isn't sucking your life away. So that's what we're doing here. Uh, I'm so glad you signed up. If you have any questions, you can DM me on Twitter at Tim Stodds and I'll see you on the next video.